That's that shit. Wow. Whoa! We all saw it. Baby, there ain't nobody like you. Do you feel the same? Because I got high hopes. Welcome back, guys. Happy Friday. Um, don't mind my empty picture frames. So, actually, story time. Chins is on a way, by the way. So, I've always had this shelf above these ovens. And I've never known what to do with it. I've always been like, what the fuck do I put in the shelf? I thought like, do I put like some ornaments or blah, blah, blah. And I just didn't know. And then I had a genius brainwave to put picture frames up there. So, so far we've only got Bonnie in the frame. Um, I basically just went to buy all these frames and then realized that I actually don't have any physical pictures. So um, I think actually maybe tomorrow, I think I'm gonna go and print some pictures out so I can put some pictures in the frames. But I thought that was a really nice idea because I don't have any like pictures in my house. And I feel like most houses that like, you have pictures of like family and friends. So we have picture frames. I just got them from John Lewis. Yeah, so don't mind the empty picture frames. Uh, but happy Friday, welcome back. It's currently, uh, what day is it today? It's Wednesday today. I got back, me and Chintzia both got back from London this morning. Um, so it's been a bit of a hectic day, but she is on her way over now and we're going to make some lunch. It is like so hot. It's just uncomfortable. Like I was really ready. Like September 1st, I was like, boom, like trench coats, you know, boots. Like I'm ready for just like, I got my nails done dark green. Like I was really ready for like, you know, time to get cozy. And this has just thrown a curveball. I'm just like, oh. I'm honestly not enjoying it. I'm sorry to be so negative, but I'm just not, I'm just not into it in September. Like where was this in August when I wanted it? I don't want it anymore, you know? Anyway, stop moaning. Currently got my fan like <sighs> blasting me. I got a Dyson fan, which is uh, pretty fancy. I have it in my bedroom because this house is just like really hot and <laughs> I'm literally sweating. Chintzy's gonna walk in here and be like, oh my fucking God. Um, but I just need this fan. I really recommend it. It was a bit of an investment, but I have it on like every night now. And it kind of helps me sleep because it's like, it obviously makes a noise because it's a fan, but I kind of see it as like almost like white noise. Don't know if that makes sense, but like just like the humming almost like helps me sleep. Yeah, random starts the vlog. I thought I'd just get this going whilst I wait for Mrs. Zello. Um, but she told me she would be 10 minutes, so. Yay. Hi. She it's, made it. It's lunchtime. Hair's drying very quick in this heat. I left with wet hair and I had my head out the Uber like this. <laughs> it's basically it literally dry. has come back so fuzzy and I didn't have a bubble. I was like, oh, fuck. So we're going to make some lunch. We are so... making Mexican style roast sweet potato salad. I love Mexico. I yeah. love Mexican food. I've never been to Mexico. Look, croutons. We need to go come November. I know. Sweet potato bit of feta, everything I love. So this is from HelloFresh. So HelloFresh, thanks for watching this video. Thank you, HelloFresh. Um, if you guys haven't tried them, this all basically arrives to your door. So like, here's all the ingredients. So like a bag of this ingredients arrives. Right. Here's all the instructions. It's very simple. It's literally um, the simple it all, it all showed up in this box this morning when I got home. It's, it's very easy. It's and foolproof cooking and you can pick whatever recipes you want. Like you can have meat options, plant-based options, vegetarian yeah. fish ones. Like I generally pick the fishy ones. Same. And like the veggie ones. Same. But there's so loads look, of meat ones. We haven't had to do a food shop. Yeah. And we've got a beautiful so meal. So we've got, we got back this morning, we've got a beautiful lunch. Great. Bon appetit. And lunch We're gonna dessert. share. This is actually so beautiful. We've got the feta, sweet potato, and the croutons. That's I, really quick. It's literally so hot, so we love a bit of a salad on a hot day, innit? Hallelujah. Hallelujah, delicious. Right, lunch is served. Got a code, Sophia Chintzia. Link is down below also. So, thumbs up. Right. God, I'm stuffed. We are that was gonna. surprisingly filling. It was delicious. It was the croutons it was, and the sweet yeah, potatoes because there was carbs in it. Yeah. Because sometimes, that's why when I make that salad, I always make it. I always have to put the beans in it. Otherwise, it's just like Doesn't empty. The same. But you're going to, we're going to, I'm going to go to mum's now. I'm going to go Lydia. work out. So you're going to come with me. Sophia's going to go work. I already been gym. She's productive. I already been gym, washed, have a bath. It was, uh, the gym was hot. It was hot. Uh. It was hot. I was like, Fuck this. this spot also will not vacate my face. <laughs> it's literally just like, it's, it's just there now. Hi, I'm at mum's. 
I look crazy because my hair is curly. Lydia's here, but she's being a diva. She doesn't want to be on camera. I just look ugly. Um, <laughs> oh my gosh. I look like I've just finished work. Like, literally, Lydia. <laughs> I look like I've just finished mine. You look like an old um, headmistress. Well, look, like, look, yeah, I look like Miss Trunchbull. But it's cool when I've got, it's because I've got fake no fake tan on and I'm pale and my hair looks crazy. But I just did a grocery order to here and I've decided I'm going to make dinner here so that I don't make mess at my own flat. I make mess in this kitchen because my kitchen's nice and clean and I don't want to make mess there. And my dishwasher's broke. So, you know, all those factors. So we've got, I'm just going to make a salad. I've got better basically essentially kind of what we had for lunch well a salad with feta minus the croutons and the sweet potato but i've got salad i've got avocado cucumber and i've got cannelloni beans and then i'm gonna get some tuna and i'm gonna have some dinner i've just been chilling here just haven't seen mummy in a while even though she's gone out should we go find honey oh are you waiting for mummy are you waiting for mummy and you just miss mummy and you're just waiting for mummy on the floor like this? Oh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Honey went to a farm today and mum said that mum said that you were eating pig poo. You were eating pig poo. She was eating pig poo. Kiss me. Mm. Kiss me. Mm. Let's make this dinner. I've just been chilling really, it's so hot, I can't really do anything. Lydia is going to come to London on Saturday with me. Um, that was a maybe. Because I'm going to be alone all day on the Saturday. So Lydia's going to come and see that, it's going to be a really nice time. I might actually make some rice cakes uh, with avocado and feta, which is really nice. Oh, it's my storage, I leave my storage here. Oh my god. Oh, this is a very full fridge. Alpro Choco milk. Yum. It's a treat coming here, I tell you. I had some food. Now we're in the, I'm in the bathroom with Mary and we're going to dye her hair red. Woo! Electric reds. Ruby reds. I've already been pink, blue. She's the cool green. sister. Pink, blue, green. Basically, she's it's, got these blonde bits it's underneath. It's blonde at the moment, so I'm going to dye it red. So we're going to go red for crazy. What's the red choice? Why did you choose the red? Why not? Why not? She says she's going to be fire girl. No, I didn't. For Halloween. Halloween. That's what Lydia and Cynthia said. It literally looks like blood. Whoa, what are we listening to? Phoebe Bridges. Phoebe Bridges. And we've got red. Look at that. Wow. Hi guys. I'm literally walking around naked right now, but I just um, fake tanned. And I feel... Sophia is just texting me. Fantastic. So I've just fake tanned, I feel nice again, just a little bronze, I've got to wash it off in the morning. But I used, basically I ran out of my Saint-Tropez. Normally I'm a Saint-Tropez Express Tan. Oh, it's right here. Hmm, I thought I ran out, but it's literally right here, I did not use my eyes. In extra dark, this is amazing. But I also have the Saint-Tropez Ashley Graham one and i've never seen anything more olive toned and not green in my life it's just beautiful it's just be and it comes off really quite well like i was a bit patchy but whatever you know you can't whatever it is what it is well i was at mum and dad's and Marianne was doing her hair basically Marianne's hair looked really nice she's gone red lovely lovely um i've decided that i'm just gonna go to the salon tomorrow and get my hair and just get the bob at 12. 12 p.m. Romano is gonna give me the bob and I'm sick of it and I'm done with it because this it's just I think the ends are really quite thin and I've been wearing it up too much so I'm getting breakage because I'm for all I want to do is scrape it back. So I need a lease alive. I can't be asked with the fucking I was gonna get the extensions, I can't be asked. The tapes, the long, the drying the long hair, the tape sticking out, and I'm just thinking, I'm just gonna cut it. He's free tomorrow at 12, I'm gonna go sorted bob 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 i wanted to get it dyed as well but it's dark enough in it because i could go like dark and don't like uh, to be fair my hair's as dark as it can go it's just the roots i think they're a bit lighter a little bit no they're not no my hair's looking dark so 
I'm gonna do that tomorrow so um I can vlog a little bit of that. Um, but yeah, that's that that's the shebang. And what I'm gonna start tonight, I'm gonna start because because I was so obsessed with Married at First Sight Australia, Married at First Sight UK has just started. And I've seen some teasers on TikTok. Looks phenomenal, almost looks as good as Australia. So I'm pretty sure it looks almost more dramaful, which I enjoy, I'm not opposed to. So I'm here for it. I'm going to watch it in bed. I'm gonna, that's why I did my times out early. It's only half eight. So yeah, that's the plan. Get again in bed. Watch right at first sight and enjoy my life. I finally got a coffee machine. I love her so much. I've wanted her for so long. I just went on Amazon. She was about 60 pounds, I think, from Amazon. Um, and it's just like, it's not that fancy. It's just really simple. It's just literally, well, I'm going to make one, so I'll show you. But then I got a milk frother as well. And the milk frother is the game changer. So this, I just, this is a, I just got from John Lewis. Um, and these are the pods that I've been using. I'll tell you the flavor because it's the better flavor. The milk frother really is the best part. Look, we just put a pod in, it goes down. Oh, this is like the best part of my day, like every morning. And then we just press, who would have thought? And it just comes out. So you know how some machines have like 50 different settings of like which drink you can make? Like I do like that sometimes. They have like a latte option, or like a cappuccino option, but um, I just got this one, which is just like a one button situation because I can't be bothered to faff about with all that. Why isn't it working? My demonstration has failed me. Oh, I think I had to warm up. So yeah, I'm chuffed with that. Amazon, next day delivery. Why is... Okay, it's working. Still new to the coffee machine. And these are the pods that I've got, which I really recommend. So let me get my box so I can tell you the flavor. They are called, this is Bianco Leggero, something like that. But I literally just got four boxes of these because this is just like a good flavor for me. If you don't like coffee, like I know they have really loads of really nice flavors that are like caramel and vanilla and blah, 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 blah. But I just don't, I don't like like sweet, like coffee. I just like normal like a normal cup. I just should put some more pods in. So this is also my favorite milk, my friend Summer. She um, recommended this to me and it's really good. I honestly, I hate to say it because I bought Oatly for years, but I kind of prefer it. <coughs> Sorry. So yeah, this is the milk frother. So you just press the button and it just <laughs> whizzes it up and then you get really nice foamy coffee and it's really tasty. So, yay. This is honestly just like the best part of my day right now. This is it, guys. You're seeing it. This is the highlight of my day. So I tried to recall my coffee pouring and I didn't realise I poured it all over the side. But still, do we see the foam on that? This is honestly fantastic. It makes it really foamy. So if you actually don't like a foamy coffee, then I wouldn't recommend this little contraption. But, oh, for fuck's sake. To be honest, it kind of looks kind of artistic. We recorded the single files. Oh, the last, the last one. Single files ever. <gasps> next, it's going to be the engaged files. The bride files. That'll be next. Pregnant files. Pregnant files. The mummy files. Woo! Why do I keep. So, Chintz is going to go and get her bob. I'm going to go get my hair. I'm so now. fucking excited. I will try. I'm just sick. Look at this. I mean, it's I love actually it, but... really quite dead. It's I think really... you just like thrive with a bob. Like that is just like your hairstyle. Like well, not many people look good with a bob, you know? Look at all this breakage. Look, mm. that's from wearing it up all the time. So I'm, tr I'm trying to... Look at that. That's oh not normal. So I need to save it. So it would be a nice change. Like... You know how quick yeah. it's going to be for you to dry your hair and shit? It's going to be amazing it's to wash it. Really Nice. It'll feel so and thick. I, I need to get some new like hair oil and mm -hmm. some products. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking maybe a mousse, mm -hmm. nice oil, mm -hmm. maybe I don't know, just to keep it in a. I used a uh, um, whey hair mask when I washed my hair today. Nice. It was, it's in like a grey pot. Nice. I think I own that. Yeah, because my hair was just feeling so I dry. I have conditioner, so that would help. Because mm -hmm. I need to. In it. Mm -hmm. Get the moisture back. But yeah, I'll take you with me, guys. Yeah. I'm gonna leave that for, I need to put some clothes on, which is that hair naked. Yeah, right. All right. See you when you've got a bob.
Thank you. Hi. I am ready. I am dressed. I am ready to go get my hair done. I'm going to give you a quick visual of the length. So pretty long. Like, and this is my natural, like, curly. It's a bit, it's like a bit fuzzy, curly. But this is how long it is. So we're going for, we're going for a fucking, oh my God, I look crazy in this, like, literally so fuzzy. I can't wait to get it washed nicely. I'm just putting it up. back well it's been some time now um i went to mum's showed her spent some time with her but ta -ta -ta, it's gone a bit um i need to put some product in it but what do we think da, 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 da. i literally don't know how to act it's actually mad Woo! where's the good it feels so thick and healthy and just nice I, I didn't feel like I need it dying actually. It's really quite dark, isn't it? Um, but literally, it's so thick on the ends. If you're thinking about just cutting your hair, just do it. Just do it. So we're going into winter. Just do it. I'm really happy with it. I just feel, you know, just like so nippy and I, I feel so free. So I got a few, because I was like, Dad, I've got no products to like do my fucking short hair now so i remember i've spoke about this before remember this when i'd wear my hair down hold to fear to get it this bauman leave-in conditioner spray like this is like if you've got long hair short hair just to like smells amazing just to like refresh it once like so even now because you see how it's gone a bit fuzzy just like a little bit Cause it's not like oil like oil makes it oily do you know what i mean but you see how that just like tamed it and made it look more sleek do you see that i've already used a whole bottle of this literally just makes it did, did you see that come on look it just went less fuzzy it's literally incredible it looks like water but it's like and it makes your hair smell nice it's like hair perfume and then i got this moisturizing styling cream because i'm thinking before I blow dry it, like I need to figure out how to dry it so it kind of flicks under. So I might get myself like a round brush, like I really need to like figure this out. Um, but I'm really excited. And I'm gonna start like curling it again and like doing side parts and just like being, being a bit more adventurous with it down, you know what I mean? And if I <clears throat> wanna put it back, I've got a little, oh, that's kind of cute. A little little flick look how sick that is look at that jesus anyway that's that um yeah we're gonna go to london tonight we're in london tomorrow having a nice day out um and then but now i think you're gonna watch the get ready clips yeah this was uh lydia's 21st birthday night out uh and it was really fun we had a great time so it was pre-bob unfortunately that dress would have looked so nice with the bob what a shame but I'm going to sort my shit out now, have some dinner. And yeah, thanks. Well, you're going to about to watch the thing in it. So yeah, enjoy. Love you. Thanks for the love on the bob. You're all loving it on. Uh, it's just like I could be dramatic and be like, what? 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 What did you say? Hi. I just like it. Really flicky. Um, yeah. Love you. Oh, it's party time, ladies party and gents. Time. What's going on? Who's ready to get fucked up? I'm a little gas. I'm not gonna lie. I'm hungover. She's just so silly. Very silly. Getting very I got drunk. Wrapped into something that I didn't expect. And, I just uh, kept going. Well, do you know what I've realised? Yeah. We don't need to drink a lot. Oh, we don't. And I was also, Sophia, who you're with. You don't drink the same amount as who you're with. I honestly, that's what right? we've learned. So I was out with six or seven. These lads, right? And it, literally in the shower about what were you half even an hour drinking? ago. I was saying to myself, I was like, every time they got a drink, I got a drink. And that is so stupid. Yeah. You literally say, no, I'm all right. Yeah. I'm still I going. don't need one. Also, Just because the glass is empty, it doesn't need an instant refill. Right. 
Right. I know That's how I've there's le- the... I I processed it about half an hour ago. I was like... I know how... I don't you... need to drink the same amount as them. Right. Well, I'm glad you finally realised that. I think I realised that It didn't that hit me in sooner. April. <coughs> oh my God, the cough. There's the coughing still here. <coughs> I'm on the last angle, day. Guys. I'm on the last day of the cough. Really God, that is dirty. So it's Lydia's birthday weekend. I managed to get the balloons. Oh gosh, she was a trooper. I was a trooper. I was vomiting. She was like, I've got I, 15 balloons. Well, it was like half 10 in the morning. Tell I was them like, in the buckle that you had. Well, I, I went in. It's hot and in here, isn't it? Is it? I think I've just got sweats. Where's the and water that? Could you, sorry, could you yeah. just shut me that? So I was with my boyfriend and... You are. <laughs> it's weird to say that. <laughs> you who? But I'm just setting the scene. So we go into this party shop and I just say to the man, I was like, I need... I, like, I was like, you know, how long will it take you and, you know, for 50 balloons, 50 helium balloons? And he was like... Whoa. He was like, that is a lot of balloons. Do no, you realise? No, it's not. And I was like, oh God, is it a lot of balloons? And then I was trying to visualise how many balloons 50, 50 balloons. was. And then not there many, was a balloon there. And and uh, my boyfriend was oh, like, yeah. it's not going to fit in my car. I was like, how, how do you think it's going to get in my car? How are you going to get in a taxi back to your hotel? It would fit in his car. And I was like, oh gosh, how many is 50 balloons? And then the, the man was like, the they man who worked there, the bag. he was like, 50 balloons is a lot of 50 balloons. And I was like, oh. I was I'm like, surprised he was turning down the business. Like, this is... Well, in the end, balloons. I ended up with 15 balloons. And it still actually looks fine. So actually, 50 was a lot. And it only cost me 30 quid. So and I was going to get... Um, the original plan, I was going to spend £300 on balloons. So, so we're in I'm, I'm glad in the end I only spent thirty pounds on balloons because three hundred pounds on balloons. I, Lydia, I love Lydia. She doesn't deserve three hundred pound worth of balloons after the presents I got her. If they were like for her house, yeah, and then they're in the and house, then they live there for, for a, a while. while. It's worth it, but just for a oh fuck, just for a uh, you know what was that concealer? I, I just realised I put these earrings in before. Oh no, okay, that one comes out. I've got these little huggies in from okay, Astrid and me. You. I, put, I slept in them and they didn't hurt. I, I put these earrings in from, I think they're from Icy Season. Like when I first got, do you know what? I've been able to smell a truffle. Have you ate anything truffle? No, do you know what I smell all the time? Halloumi. I'm not joking. I, I had halloumi today. But I've been smelling truffle no. all, I'm like... Who's been eating tr- truffle all day? No, I, I smell halloumi all day. Like, I was in my taxi earlier, I was like... Even here when I came in, I was like... I don't know if it's, like, my illness. Um, but I have not had halloumi since... Didn't even have it in Greece. What? No. I didn't have it in Greece. Are you joking? I had you Greek gave it all the talk. I'm going to go to Greece and eat all the yeah, Greek food. Yeah, I, I ate all the Greek food. I had all the tzatziki... <laughs> All the Greek salads. Oh, the Greek salads. My first Greek salad in Greece. Wow. Sophia's Hit not different. Sophia's been in Greece. She's never had a Greek salad in Greece. Do you? As I still find that incredible. We didn't eat. I know. I know we didn't there. eat cheese, but you know how like a Greek salad. I know. I always shout at me about it. No, I'm just saying because Greek salad is such a staple in my diet these days. Yeah. Feta, Our diet has changed. Like you know what makes me laugh is Mum even turns her nose up at feta. She's like, oh, goat's milk. Or is it sheep's milk? She's like, oh, oh God, I just can't get with that. I just can't get with that. I'm like, Angie, you drink cow's milk. <laughs> and that makes me feel sick. My fake tan is kind of deteriorating. I need to get back on the fake tan. I have a tree. little I've bit. I've tan since my whole life. Do you want to see my little bit of tan? I only got tan on my back. Now, why is that? Is that, there it is. Yeah, that's, that's well real. Brown. Yeah, but round the front. Did you, did you sunbathe or... So the what happened? Is, so you went with fake tan on? I went with fake tan on. Sophia, I didn't go patchy at all. On. Wow, that's I literally really good. didn't go patchy at all. And I didn't even moisturise. I'll tell you that. I wow, didn't even moisturise. Because I was, couldn't be asked because it was too cold in that room to moisturise because of the aircon. And I was like, fuck that. Um, and 
So, yeah. did you actively sunbathe or not? Uh, I was in the sun. It was so windy. I was in the sun, but it's so much more comfortable to just lay on my belly. Yeah, you, I just, you I, are a belly liar, so I was just, I'm not a belly liar at all. It's so much more comfy because then I, I I'm was... I'm a back liar. It was like five days in and I realised, oh my God, my back is really brown because I've just been lying on my belly. Yeah. But nothing came out there. I know, just a few drops. Um, but you know where we're staying? Someone next door got their wallet stolen. Because it's not it was nice. It was like the it's next... horrible having your bag stolen. Remember when my bag got stolen oh, yeah. out of my car? Oh my gosh, yeah, that was my ages car got ago, smashed. wasn't it? It was my fault because I left my bag in the car, but But it's like that's really It's a horrible feeling. It's like oh well, or it's like when you like are out and about, like when my phone got stolen, you reach in your pocket and you just yeah. know it's gone. It's like oh, horrible. It's like oh it's the worst. Well, it's cause it was kinda open it's like you could there was no security it was like it was like a small hotel it was like actually yeah. a villa so there was no like security like yes. to go up to the doors okay so you've got to like lock your doors oh, and shit, apparently right, okay. at like 2 a.m people were trying the doors and so if yours was uh, open they were walking in and they just took these people's wallets luckily ours were fucking locked but someone tried our door then in the middle of the night because oh the next morning God. the lady was like you know make sure you lock your doors i was like whoa that is petrifying. I know. But then the couple, they were so chill about it. They were American. Like, oh my God, it happens. Like, it's totally fine. I mean, it does happen. Yeah. Like, you just cancel the cards. Yeah. Just if you've got, like, cash in your wallets and... Yeah, especially if you've got loads of cash. If you're, if you're a cash carrier, you know. Oh, these spots are so hard to hide because they're like, you know, when they're like a dark scab now? It's getting a bit dark in here, isn't it? A little bit. Little. Not too dark on the camera. I know, but in, in it's dark uh, for makeup. real life. I can't wait for food tonight. Oh, you know what I started watching excited. last night? Clickbait. Oh, me too. Oh Not my Not last God. night, but the night oh before my last God. night. How many you in? <sighs> two. Same. I think I'm about two and a half in. Yeah. The guy from Princess Diaries. Yes, that that's where he's from. Yeah. Oh my god, he's the, the brother! brother oh Princess my Diaries. god! You know, yeah, the whole time, and I was like, where the fuck is this man from? I was like, where the fuck is this man from? As soon as I saw it, I was like, oh, it's the boy. Because I was Princess thinking Diaries. it was, what's his name from, um, what was the show where he was like creepy and. Oh, you? Yeah, he was giving me those vibes. Yeah, well, and he's, I, cause cause he's done I was trying that to think other. Of, has he been, he was, was there something called like the sinner that he was in? Oh, I'm not sure. See, I, that's kind of similar the vibes. only thing I saw this man in was Princess Star. Right, too. I'm going to try this light. If we shine this light in our face, I feel like I can't see. Light Thanks. me up, baby. Oh, a long time no get ready. Oh, why is that? Why have we not done a get ready in ages? We've not actually <laughs> been, I went to a club last well, night. We have. Oh, this one doesn't work. I went to a club last night and that's the first club I've been in. What was it like? In, do you know what? I. What about that? Is that look shit? But just because yeah. we could look that way. That is like Halloween like. It's another oh ghost my God, story. Halloween. <gasps> we'll make do. My hair's wet. I'm just going to put it my up wet. My hair's wet as well. What are you going to do with your hair? I don't know. It depends what I wear. I'm just going to put it up wet because it's easier to put up. And then the next day my hair's clean and fresh and still wet. Yeah, well, a Seriously. wet bun is like really nice look. Yeah, that's the one I'm just going to... Because I was going to do a pony. I was like, I can't be asked. to Maybe fucking... yeah, I should do a wet bun. Well, it's easy. And I've got all the gel for it. And all the I products. No, you don't look funny with a bun. Why would you look funny with a bun? I don't know. Why would you... If you do a really high... I'm going to do a really high bun. What are your suggestions? What do you guys think we should do for my birthday? Where should we go? We're thinking a little 24. trip. Four. I was going to say 25 Jesus then. Christ. May as well That's be 25. a big age, you know. Sophia, I know. Fuck. It's actually like... I feel like life is going really quickly and I'm scared. Me too. But also I'm like... Let's just all Why stop. is this black thing not getting off my face? Can you just grab that black thing off my face? Yeah. Short nails to the rescue. Oh my god. I know, it keeps moving around. Got it. There we go. But also, I'm secure in the fact that I'm going to be at my prime when I'm 35. It's a blessing to get older. So, oh, actually, goodness. I'm quite excited. I'm excited. It's a fun thing. Do you know what? I'm excited to move away from the 20s. I feel like... God, you're only 24. <laughs> you're going into no, your 30s. You know, like, you I'm excited to leave the 20s behind. leave the 20s behind. 20s behind. But, you, you, you know, 20s are hard. Like We actually spoke we'll, to a woman yesterday. And we'll she be so said... Mature. Imagine how mature we'll be when we're 35. 
Are you mad? Oh, we'll be so mature. I, um, we spoke to a woman last night, didn't we? Last night, what yesterday. Woman? What woman? Who said that, you remember when I tell the story. Oh. Who said that um, she was like 40. Oh my gosh. And she said that, because we were saying how like, oh, we think like, you know, the school age is like a real, like, you know, the years like, 16 like to like 20 is like a really difficult time like yeah. there's a lot going on like friendships are changing like Constantly. relationships are happening you and don't like know breaking. who you are completely yeah like you've got all those questions of like where you're going with life and stuff and she was like yeah totally agree totally agree and then she said she was like but i think like the hardest time like in a woman's life is her 20s yeah and i was it, like that, that's what oh. that's what i realized i was like wow it is though because, you reckon? Yeah, because yeah, I, there's a lot of pressure on women. Well, in the you're 20s. navigating everything. Like you're figuring out what you want. Do it's you the want pressure. To have twenties. Kids? Is, what do you want, want your career to be? I feel like twenties is like the pressure of like, is your life together yet? Well, like, it's like, have you got your career yet? Yeah, like, it's like you're li you're moving out. Have you bought a place yet? Are, are you, you gonna in... settle down yet? Are you gonna have kids in your twenties? Are you right. gonna wait? It's like all of that. Your relationships. Your relationships are constantly changing. Like friendships. Like. You know, unless you're blessed with, you know, I don't know, oh, a part of, a, a, yeah, or, you know, a partner, you know, that would last your whole 20s. Do you know what I mean? But That's it's like, impressive. But then it's like, are they really right for you? You know, did they help you grow or are they mm. holding you back? Mm. You know, all these things. Be, well, I'm sorry, good. it's dark. It, it's like, I can't dark. see what I'm doing. Can we, should we move to the front? I can't see what I'm doing, man. I look. Let me give us a torch. God. What's that like? Oh yeah, that's kind of, but we need our own. You can't hold that. Well, that look, like that. you stand yours up. Here we go. Who needs a ring light? Here we go. Oh yeah. Who likes my phone case? It's quite gothic. And mine. Look. Chelsea. <gasps> Aliens. Please. Actually, the short life, because I'm just a really oh, yeah. sophisticated Here we girl go. <laughs> I think the red short. What do we think of the, oh, we already did this in the vlog. I think the red short's going to be... I pretty, love the red. Olivia's got red tasty. short. Well, she's got not short short. She's got little over ones red. Nice. Really nice. Good taste. Right. So I've been listening to Drake's album a bit more. Thoughts. And it grows. It gets better. Like actually, some of the lyrics are quite well, Drake. Really? Yeah. Like you got to listen to the lyrics. Okay. There's there was one tune that that was, you know, almost unique to me. But you gotta seek it out. I couldn't tell you what the songs I've were called. I've seen it on lots of people's Insta stories. Lots of people's Insta stories. But I'm like, do you actually like it or are you just hopping on a bandwagon here? True, but Drake is. Because I've you listened know, to that song that you've posted and I think it's. Wow, that is a bold statement from Miss Sophia Tuxedo. Sorry, I don't wanna be a hater. That was a bold. Drake, I think you're amazing. I can't wait to go see Drake. When's really he gonna talented. go on tour? Will he go on tour? He's got a child now. He probably doesn't want to be. He Probably will. wants to stay. I know, but he's a family man now. He doesn't need to yeah, go on tour. He's a unless father. he really wants to go on tour. Like if I was Drake, I'd be like, I'll go on tour when he's I'd just 18. do a tour in like your hometown. Like oh, I'd do I'll LA. Just do, like, one. Just think going around the world. Fuck me, that's a but lot. You know how much money they make? Really? They literally well, it must make be worth it. hundreds of million. I'm I joking. I'm not joking. I swear I looked this up before. No wonder now, they go on tour. I don't fact check me here. It's either like a hundred million, it can't be a hundred million per show. No, it won't be. No. But it's like their whole tour grosses like a hundred, like over like 200 million or something. And they take home like loads. Fuck me. But So it's like worth it for like, you know, well, yeah, however they long. they charge like 300 pounds for a ticket. I know. And think how many seats are in the huge, huge. arenas. So. Poor blimey. Crikey. Crikey. Brow time. Tonight's going to be fun. We've got a bit of a group. We never go out with a group. Well, Girl as, group. as group as it gets is us and Summer. Yeah. Or us, Lydia and Olivia. But we've got But four. now there's six of us. And two more. So we're going to be a right uh, force. Right girl squad. <laughs> got pins and needles. Got pins what are pins and needles? I don't know. Like, what is like that? What, what is the is it? It's like when your foot goes to sleep, but like why? That's like, interesting. What is I that had feeling? pins and needles early, and I haven't had it in a while. I get it quite regularly. Do you? Mm, I do. Yeah. Uh, well, it's but just is it when the blood a, stops? It's a cut off of circulation. So is the tingling because the blood can't get through? Uh, I think because yeah, that's what maybe. it is. It's when oh, you put tingling. pressure on it and the blood can't get through. I wonder what happens if you just do it for ages. Does it then, you know, go really 
Like, will you like kill your leg? If you stop the blood flow? Well, yeah, because then... Probably go like purple, would Yeah, it? and then do you think if you kept doing it, it would eventually like drop off? I... Probably. I... Yeah, Sophia, if you did it for long enough. Well, have you seen that man who's held his hand up in the air for like 20... No. For like 30 years? Why the fuck would you do that? Well, he, it's spiritual for him. It's like oh, a. Right. Okay. It's like a. Um, I thought it was doing to get in the Guinness Book of World Records. No, it's like a. It's like a holy thing for him. Okay. Uh, I won't know. But he's had his arm up in the air for like fifty years or something, and What's the it's point? like he can't move it now because it's it's it looks just like a bone. He can't physically can't move. It's not even like he's trying to hold yeah. it up now. Like it's just stuck there now. So it's like a hunchback. Right. You know, like when you've got a hunchback, like you've got a hunchback. Wow. It's, it's fascinating. I watched a documentary. It was on YouTube. I think it was a Vice thing. I ah. Married at First Sight UK has started. Like a new series. Would you ever entertain that idea? What does that mean? What, go on it? Marry someone at first sight. Well, after watching... There, is a, there is a slim chance of it being a success. I mean, they match you based on science. That's what I mean. Like, it but, is, it's not random. But you then have also, been matched. But then also, they're trying to produce a reality show. Of course. It's one so drama. I'm like, is okay, it... Okay, well, let's is, forget about the it, reality show. Is it all the science? How would you feel about, like, what was that TV show? Have we yeah. spoke about this? Not where sure. it's like, this is like the... Um, like we have found, like we. Oh my god! And it's, and it's the clock, and it's yeah. like you will be with this person for five years. No, not that one. That's the. Oh, one. that one was incredible. It was yeah, like that was good. So you move into a house, and it was like so. It's literally on your clock. It's like two year, two and a half years. With it's this like person. this relationship. Yeah, will be five Met years. Mad. And and then oh and my god! Like, and then you just get into a, and then they put you in with a new relationship. It's like this one's six years, and you're like, oh my god. Fuck. Bizarre, but then wasn't it the two people? Weren't they like in love or and they like trying to fight? And they didn't want to end it. Yeah, yeah, something like that. It was like they tried to rebel. Yeah, go on. But Which what do you think about like? like being like matched with someone off of like science? Well, listen, like yeah. you are like chemical. Not what's the word? Yeah, like scientific. We found your soulmate. You know, like throughout through through science. Yeah. So we've matched your person. Everything about you with right. everything about right. this person. Well, there's got you've got to have some faith in it, right? But then it's like there's something so nice about meeting someone unexpected. Right. Depends how badly you want to find someone in the moment. Right. Do you know what I mean? But uh, if they're right for you, maybe that will be an invention in the future. Probably, because it's all over the TV shows. Would you go to space if you could just buy a ticket to go to space? No. No, what if it was super safe and it was just like a thing? No, I... What if you could rehome your family and go to Venus? No. Go to Mars? No. I have, like, zero fascination it... about space. Like, I... Really? Yeah, when I sit and think about the fact that we are floating in space, it just scares... I find space petrifying. It is scary. Like, I find space scary. I've got no need to go up to space but what if like i'd been a couple times and i was like it's great up there I'd like, like oh, there's nice send restaurants me you know there's nice restaurants i mean look maybe i would but i have no burning desire and in say me. It, i have no passion in me to get to space you know i think it would scare me i think until it was like totally normal to go to space and like like getting on a bus do you think Katy perry by russell yes. brand a, a seat i believe for 100k so. yeah seat to space did that seat ever happen um because it was with richard branson was it not why don't you google it yeah that's not in the range I think of my it knowledge did. is it spacex where'd you get all these facts from i don't know i've got a boyfriend like space now uh, oh really well i watch a lot of i but i watch a lot of space uh have you seen arrival i told you to watch that Asian yeah show. you did and i was with someone that wanted to watch that. i was like i'm not watching that yeah What's his name would like it? What's his name would like it? I was it? like, oh, Chinsy recommended that. I was like, I'm not watching You know, that. he won't watch things you recommend because you Who? recommended something shit one time. Me? Because I said I wanted to watch Grace and Frankie. He said, well, if Sophia recommends it, it's going to be shit. Because what did I recommend you that was shit? I think you recommended us something before. It was that one where someone died straight away. That thing where someone died straight away. 
Remember? No. Ages ago. It was ages ago, Sophia. I have full faith in all my recommending. I have faith in it! Sophia, you're gonna have to have I've a got a bone with. to pick you're gonna now. You're going to have a word with him. Are you going to do anything on your eyes? No. No? Lydia's getting her eyes properly done. Lydia's going out with proper. Well, yeah, it's her birthday. Oh, Olivia's I'm really just here for moral doing. support. Would you be able to reach my bag for me, doll? Oh, how far away is that? Oh, jeez. My lip liner Christ. and all my possessions are in there. Oh. That's the traffic. Let's sing one of the new Drake songs. I have um, no one, to be honest. It goes like. And it went like. It goes like. Wah, wah. Oh, I literally don't even wah, know. Wah. Oh, I know how one of them goes. Got a sharpener. Um. Yes. We've not been to a club. You haven't, we haven't well, we've we haven't been, been well, no, we, we have. What the fuck's going on here? What are you doing? There you go. No, it's oh not my God, what the hell? Okay. I mean, we've been to, we've been dancing and, uh, we've been, where actually we think it's a club? Cosmo Bar. That was a club. <laughs> that was a bar. It, it felt like a club yeah, to me. Yeah, it felt like a club to me as right, well. It's twisting very slowly. I don't need a bit. Whoops. Who remembers on New Year's Eve? We've had to go. Really fancy eye. Do you remember when I did that incredible eye? Do you remember when I did that incredible, intricate eye? Was it? Fucking hell with the concealer, yeah. the cut crease. The cut crease. Wow, because I'm thinking, well, Bronfo no, I can't do that now. Sorry, camera died. <coughs> I did charge it in my defense. I think the battery may have corrupted. How do we do this? Like that? There we go. Hi. Is it Hi. A bit, a bit, is it a bit high? There's the shit. Wow. Whoa! We are so in sync. That's freaky. Wet. Freaky Friday. Freaky Friday. This is our setup. I've also got a bruise. Now, oh my God. I, you know. Oh my God. Yeah. Let me tell you. Look at that. That is dark. It's so like. That such is a circle. So, it's like smaller. That's very dark. And you know dark. when they just appear and it's like, where's that come from? That's very dark, Sophia. God, Watch what's this. going on here? Are you ready, guys? Makeup tutorial. So this is actually a lip liner, I believe. But it's very black. It's brown. Oh, I could do a lip. You know, I did a little black little like like wing with like a proper. But look, everyone watch. So makeup tutorial. We're gonna smudge this out. Okay. We're gonna smudge. So this is a Morphe lip liner. Oh god, do I look in here or no? I look in here. So we're, we're gonna smudge it out. So. Whoa. Whoa. Jesus Christ. Look at that. Wow. Chang. Just let's look at extra lash. Could cut a knife with that. Wow. And then we're gonna Could cut a knife? What I didn't mean to say that. You could cut cut what do you Sharp say? Sharp as a knife, cut something, I don't know. Oh, it's like a you can cut that like a knife. <laughs> it's not cut. I don't cut know. Oh my god, do you know what I watched the other day on Netflix? You should actually watch this. This this baking thing. Oh what the fuck was it called? It was like cake. It was like cake. It was like cake. I fucking love cake. It was like level cake. And it was like, it was like Bake Off, but American and better. Wow. All right, and are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? Are you ready for this? Get yourself a little mini. And we're gonna... What was that? Um, Space Jam. Wow, that's coming out very... You know there's a new Space Jam? I do, yeah. I used to watch the old Space Jam all the time. It was a big film in my household. Oh, what is going on? Can you help me? You're not helping me. Yes. You just had it pointing at the ceiling. There we go. A slanted. But it'll, be, fi off. it'll be fine because uh, it's like that. What's that? Right. Y'all ready for this? Look at that. We get it. You're a makeup artist. I was actually going to pursue that, but... YouTube, Good job he didn't. Yikes. YouTube took off and here we are today. YouTube but I still my name. like to pursue my passions once in a while. So my hair's dried anyway. It's not even fucking wet anymore to do the wet bun. So hot in here. Under the tap. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. A bit more intense than that one. Oh, God, that's fucking God. dark. What's going on? This is my daily lip liner. Jeez Louise. Ew, your t fucking toe just touched my toe. Do you well, realise your, your toe away from my toe? But your toes just went on top of my toe and you just slowly <laughs> moved them away off my no, toe. No, I didn't. You, I haven't moved my feet. Oh, God. It's Chintz's fragrance. This is ripped. Look how nice my toenails look, also. Everyone, look. Oh, did you 
you get them jeans? Yeah, you know I lost a toe. She Nailed. did, yeah. This this pinky there, but she drew on it, so it looks like it's there. Look. Oh. Yeah, but there's oh, nothing there. It's just flesh. Right, I'm gonna go and sort my hair out. Try and get a bit more. I think I'll be able to cover that. Style. Appropriate. Um, I'm just gonna do a bug. Can't be asked. Have you got straighteners with you? Yes, no. I do. Uh, I might just do straight. I have straighteners with me. I oh, know my hair looks shit straight. This Not is um, right. So G to G, G to G. Let me just get ready. What does that mean? G to G. What does that mean? Oh, got to go. Goodness me. I've never heard it. You G catch up. G. You catch on quick. You G did. to G. Never heard that before in my life. G to G. You go, you just say got to go though. Don't you? G T G. Yeah, but if you want to be cool, G Because you say B R B. Right. right. Stop being a hater. Well, well, whoa. Whoa. Wow. Whoa. Wow. Whoa. 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 Oh, I've never been 21, so well. Yes, same. Oh, I thought I was staying on it. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Mums are on their so way. I feel like we're looking after the kids Well, tonight. I ordered an XL taxi for everyone, but it only seats five and there's six of us, so we let the kids get in. And the we stayed back. Away. They can't get in without me anyway. The, the booking's <laughs> under my name, so they're the ones we're waiting in the cold, so. They can't get in without us. It is what it is. I can't believe it. Yeah, I suppose. But a normal size is just five seats. And the XL was just five as well. More leg room. No, it need, you needed one of the bigger ones. That wasn't like a. I know. You needed one of because there is three on that side on those. I know. Bigger ones, but lesson learned.